So, we're going to do a demonstration today with a superconductor. Um, we'll talk a little bit more about superconductors later on um, in the year, but I happen to have the liquid nitrogen here today, so I'm going to go ahead and do this one today. But this is a yttrium. Let me confirm that. Yttrium or yttrium? Yes, yttrium, barium, copper oxide. Ooh, baby. Super conductor. Um, uh -oh. Oh, the, it, there's okay. been a uh, challenge for many years now to create a, a superconductor, something that conducts electricity without any real reason. Um, That's awesome. Any real resistance. Um, and there's been lots of different ceramics that have been tried. This here is just the latest. Um, <clears throat> I shouldn't say the latest. This was one of the first successful attempts uh, at it. Is this yttrium barium uh, uh, copper oxide superconductor? Uh, the downside is most superconductors work only at very low temperatures, and so for this one here, um, uh, we're going to use liquid nitrogen then to cool it down. Okay. Or actually, I think I went a little too much too cold. in there. I want it hotter. What are you talking about? That's so cool. Oh my god, I just broke water in there. You broke it. Do it again. No, I'm going to take onto that. A magnet here. No. That is. Whoa. Oh, whoa. That's cool. Whoa, it's spinning really fast. And you can see here that it is, of course, levitating above the superconductor until I get over too far away from it. The because the only slowing force is air resistance, which is relatively small compared to friction. I when I spin it here I can actually spin it and it'll stay spinning for a while there. You'll notice that I'm able to just take it and reposition it pretty much wherever I want above the liquid nitrogen, and it stays where I reposition it. This is a black Why does it not go back? There is, um, that my guess would be a weight issue, and and trying to balance out um, center gravity, low spot, and, and, and such. Um, there's probably also a little bit from the fact that this is liquid nitrogen giving off nitrogen gas, and therefore there's some gas probably causing it to rock as well. But you'll notice I'm able to pass the tweezers underneath of it and above it, so there is no strings holding it here. I suppose I should do it like no magic. Let's hear no magic involved. Black magic is worse than regular. Harry Potter style. <laughs> What do you say about Harry Potter? We all looked over there. 